my name is Whitney Landine, and I'm from Palo Alto, California. My business is Sonnet James, and I'm seeking $350,000 for 25% equity. It is so important for parents to play with their kids, but too often our clothes hold us back from our parenting adventures. Well, sharks, I'm here to tell you it doesn't have to be that way anymore. I'm the mother of two messy, wiggly, beautiful boys. To them, grass stains are just a sign of a day well spent. But on my clothes, they're an expensive dry cleaning bill just waiting to happen. Mm -hmm. I thought, what if there was a dress that made it easy for moms to get down on their kids' level and immerse themselves in their adventures, but also made them feel confident and attractive? If you're a mom tired of yoga pants like I was, then this is your new mom uniform. They feel like pajamas, but will make you look and feel put together. You can head to the city for a work meeting, take your two-year-old on a bike ride, pick up the boys from baseball practice, and go straight to date night with your husband without ever having to change. And the best part, when those banana hands have been wiped clean on your dress, just throw it in the wash and you're good to go. Cute. Help me build a world where parents are more young at heart, present in the moment, and more playful with the ones they love. Our kids are still young, but the days of being invited on their adventures are running out. What's your background? I had kids young. I was 22 when I had my first child, and I decided to be a stay-at-home mom. And fairly soon after, I became a single mom. I was going through a difficult time in my life, and so I had this idea of making a dress that my mom could have worn that could have reminded her to play with me when I was little. And I said, all right, this year, I'm gonna take the idea, and I'm going to teach myself how to sew, and I'm gonna pattern draft. And every night, I would pretty much sit on the kitchen floor crying, trying to teach myself how to do two things that I had no idea how to do. And uh, I built the website, and surprisingly, a mom blogger picked it up, and she thought it was a really cute idea. And within 48 hours, I had over 150 orders. Wow. So cool. And wow. I completely freaked out. <laughs> and I called my brother and I said, I'm shutting the website down. I'm going to refund everyone's order because I have no idea how to deliver 150 dresses. <laughs> and he said, do not shut it down. <laughs> like, this is what startups dream yeah, of, you know? Yeah, that's and, right. And I was like, okay, he talked me down and I got in the car the next day and I drove to LA because I'd heard that there was fashion-y stuff in LA and I just started knocking on doors and the rest is kind of history. Great. Good for you. Can I go back to one thing on your story? Yeah. You said you were gonna design a dress that would be like a dress that if your mother had played with you, yeah. can you expound on that? Yeah, so um, I had a somewhat difficult childhood. Um, there was, um, there was um, some abuse and addiction. And, uh, you know, it was tough as a kid. You know, it's okay. My parents, my parents did the best they could with what they had, you know. I found when I became a mom, I couldn't engage with my kids as much as I wanted to. And um, I wanted something that could help me be the mother that I had always wanted to be. And something that could you know, remind me every day when I put it on what my priorities were. And I feel like that's what mothers connect with. You know, all of us have come from some dysfunction, you know, no one's childhood was perfect. And I think this band of us mothers were saying, you know, we want to do our very best. And any way I can support mothers in doing that is, is my life goal <laughs> and my mission. And I feel very honored that I am able to do what I do. You know what, how fantastic that you took adversity. Yeah. And you said, that's not gonna pull me down, it's only gonna rise me up. Thank you, And you, you did a fantastic job mm -hmm. of it. You should feel very proud of yourself. Yeah. Thank you. I am, I'm Absolutely. very proud. So Whitney, yes, I'm Sarah. in this business. Yes, right? you are. <laughs> and what I see is there isn't a huge point of difference in what you're offering from the apparel side. Okay. okay? There's lots of items and products like this all over the market. Okay. 23% return rate is a little high for how democratic of a fit this is. Okay. What does democratic fit mean? It means it's flexible. It's a forgiving yeah. garment, right? So you learn something so, every day on Shark Tank. <laughs> but I also like to invest in female entrepreneurs, and I just really like you. Thank you so much, Sarah. So What are you going to do? So, Whitney, I'm going to offer you uh, the $350,000 for 25%.
Oh what? my gosh. Wow. Thank wow. you so much. I would say much. yes before I'm someone changed I'm me. taking it. I'm taking it. I'm taking it. You can't change your mind. You can say you can. Yes, yes, yes. You're adorable. The golden ticket goes to my favorite product. I've made you a good offer. That's what I'm talking about. That is the winner. <laughs> Riding all the way to the bank, baby. Yeah. Yeah. You've come to the right place.